Welcome to Insider Medicine In-Depth. I'm Dr. Susan Sharma. Among those with symptoms of Parkinson's disease, being unable to ride a bike may be a sign of the atypical form of the disease, according to correspondence published in The Lancet. Here is some information about Parkinson's disease. It is a progressive degenerative disease affecting movement that can produce tremors, stiffness, slowed movement, and impaired balance or coordination. Individuals with symptoms somewhat like but not exactly the same as those classically associated with Parkinson's disease are said to have atypical Parkinsonism. Different types of Parkinson's disease and atypical Parkinsonism are known to have somewhat different prognoses. Researchers from Parkinson's Center Nijmegen in the Netherlands interviewed 156 individuals with early signs of Parkinsonism about their ability to ride a bike. None of these individuals had yet received a firm diagnosis for their condition. Before the first signs of Parkinsonism arose, 111 of the participants rode a bike. Among these individuals, 45 eventually received a diagnosis of Parkinson's disease, and 64 developed atypical Parkinsonism. An average of about 30 months after the onset of symptoms, 34 of the 64 individuals with atypical disease were no longer riding a bike, compared with only two of the 45 patients with Parkinson's disease. Today's research suggests that the inability to ride a bike may be a red flag that a person with symptoms of Parkinson's has the atypical form of the disease. It could be used in combination with similar red flags to distinguish between the conditions. For Insider Medicine in Depth, I'm Dr. Susan Sharma.